Just saying, man. <laughs> All right. Well, as we take a look at the WLWG radar, if you were hoping for maybe some snow to delay your cancel classes, sorry, not happening. It looks like most places, you know, the weather's been very warm recently. So even though the snow looks fairly impressive on the radar, it is kind of melting away as it hits the ground. We're taking a look at some of the areas of most intense snowfall at the moment. It's indicated by this deeper blue you see right along the 75 corridor as you head south of Dayton in through Springboro, uh, Middletown, Monroe. Uh, down toward the outlets over toward Mason as well. But again, not really sticking except to the grass. If it's trash day in your neighborhood, then stick into the trash can, stick into the car when you park outside. Those are the areas that you're going to be seeing the accumulation. The ground's still warm enough that it's melting away. Down south, a little bit closer to the Ohio River, Williamsburg to Bethel, some snow showers that are a little more intense, and right along 68 once you head south of Mount Orb. As we take a look at a wide view here, we are stuck with this snowy pattern throughout the day. So off and on snow showers, probably all the way through the evening commute, fading away after sunset tonight. With our temperatures right now a degree or so above freezing and climbing to the mid 30s through the afternoon, I would expect not a whole lot is going to stick. Now it's going to look impressive at times. Part of that due to the strong winds, our steady winds through the day are going to be in the 20 25 mile an hour range. So you're going to see wind driven snow, but not a whole lot that's actually accumulating outside right now. We're sitting at 33 degrees winds out of the west, 18 miles an hour. And you can see those flurries flying past our city cam. It feels like 22 at 8 a.m. Light snow, windy conditions. Same thing at lunchtime as we head into the afternoon, some flurries, some light snow showers and it still stays breezy through the afternoon hours. Future cast shows maybe a little bit of a break for us late morning into the early afternoon, but it will redevelop mid afternoon and again temperatures by three and four o'clock. 35, 36, 37 degrees. So even though it looks like snow for Ohio, it may actually be warm enough that you'll see a bit of a mix with some rain uh, south of the river, which will just continue to reinforce the fact that the ground should, the roads should mainly just be wet. As we head into the evening commute, snow showers continue through portions of Ohio and really throughout the day, the most likely shots to see those continued bands of snow will be along and north of the Ohio River. As we head on into tomorrow, the winds slowly slack off and here's our snowfall potential. Not exactly uh, you know, a big one for us here. We're looking at some spots maybe pushing an inch, but most of us less than that. A lot of that has to do, of course, with the melting that's occurring right now and will through much of the day. 36 degrees for our high today. Strong winds with snow showers. Tonight we're dipping down to 25 and tomorrow a little breezy 10, maybe 15 mile an hour winds. So nothing like today. Maybe a stray flurry possible, but for most of us, it's just kind of a gloomy cold Friday to get through. And then we get to the weekend, Saturday, Sunday, both days looking sunny. And next week, temperatures are going to be warm enough. They'll be talking about rain showers instead of snow. Guys? All right, Randy, thank you. New this morning, health.